Hello, it's Salimik. In today's video, I'm gonna be installing oil catch can on my 2017 Toyota Camry. And we're gonna put it under test for one month. So I have cleaned carbon build up so many times on my channel with many different ways, but it keep coming back. Let's see if with installing oil catch can, it will minimize that oil vapor that coming from PCV valve. So I found this oil catch can on AliExpress for 80 bucks by the time I'm making this video. If you look at the inside of the oil catch can, here you got the inlet and here you got the outlet with the filter. Make sure to get one with the filter. There are so many oil catch can on the market without filter. You can choose what color you like to match your car. So we're gonna need two hoses like this with 10 mm inner diameter and two 10 mm bushing so we can connect them between the PCB hose. So I had an idea to make a bracket and mount it here. I went to SketchUp to make some brackets so I can mount it somewhere close to PCV hose without extending hose that much and also easy for removing and cleaning whenever I want. Making bracket like this won't be easy if you don't have tools. So I came with this idea to make a simple bracket and mount it on the old catch can bracket so it gives me extra distance. I had to paint it matte black to match the other bracket. Alright let's attach these two together. Here I'm using two M3 by 10 mm bolts and then I'm gonna put everything back. Let's put these two bushings on the hoses. Next, let's remove these. They don't have o-rings, so I'm gonna have to use some Teflon to prevent from leaking air. PCV line is a vacuum hose, so it doesn't have to suck air into the system. Use 70mm to tighten them up. And don't forget to tighten the drain plug underneath. It came loose from the factory. To give you an idea how long are the hoses, the inlet hose will be 11 inches, which goes to inlet of the old catch can. The outlet hose will be 10 inches, which goes on filter port. Alright, our oil catch can is ready. Let's install it on the car. First of all, let's remove this bracket so we have some room to work. You just have to remove the 10 mm bolt and move it out of the way without removing the small hoses or the wire harness. Here is the hose that came from PCV valve. We're gonna remove the hose clamp and use cutter and cut it here. So we can connect the oil catch can between them. Let's remove this piece on the engine. This is the outlet of the old catch can through the filter, so this piece goes here. To give you an idea where did I cut the hose, I cut it after 2.5 inches. I also had to use zip ties even though it was tight fit. So this one goes on the engine, and this one goes on the other hose that came from PCV valve. For this one I used hose clamp instead of zip tie because I didn't have that much room to work. And the other hose goes on the intake manifold of the engine. Alright, we are done with the hoses, let's put the bracket back and tighten the bolt. And also, put the brake vacuum line back. I also used thread lockers to prevent these from getting loose. Now we need to loosen these two 10mm bolts and slide the bracket in, and then tighten it back. And the final thing, let's put the cup back, make sure it's a hand tight. This is gonna be under a test for one month to see if it collects any oil vapor. Alright, let's check the cup. I don't see oil accumulating, but let's wipe the cup with clean paper towel. It's not that much oil, but if we constantly sending that much oil into the combustion chamber, we will have carbon buildup on the piston and intake valves. I highly recommend to install oil catch can to prevent from building carbon in your engine, so you don't have to clean it once a year. I could also mount the oil catch can somewhere here, but I had to extend the hoses even more. The oil catch can link will be in the video description box below if you want to purchase the same. Alright, that's it for this video. If the video was helpful and learned something new, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.